My name is Marco Alvera. I'm the CEO of TESS. TESS is a very unique company because it combines the dynamism, the action, packed activities of a startup with the experience of a very large energy company because we have a very senior management team. So we don't have the burden of legacy assets that I faced when I was leading uh, much bigger companies and we still have the experience and the capability to execute very big projects. So the sense of urgency is really driven by how quickly the planet is warming up. It's very hard to stay within one and a half degrees. Scientists tell us that even going to 1.6, 1.7 may seem small, but has huge impacts on our planet. So the race is on to stay within one and a half. And we think ENG and TESS can play a big role in this urgency. TESS stands for Tree Energy Solutions, which means that we've inspired ourselves looking at nature. What trees do, they absorb carbon to grow. Carbon is useful, and so we figured that if you combine carbon and hydrogen, you create this very useful magical molecule that we call ENG. ENG stands for electric natural gas. That's what we call our product. It's a synthetic, renewable natural gas made entirely from renewable energy combined with CO2. This makes a product that has all the attractiveness of renewable energy. It's renewable, it's clean, and it's cheap and getting cheaper with all the benefits of hydrocarbons, of natural gas. We use it every day in factories, in the so-called hard to abate sectors. So it's the cheapest, the fastest, the quickest way of moving solar energy from a sunny desert or a windy seashore to a factory. It's, it's there to really accelerate the energy transition. Our objective in TESS is to produce by 2030 1 million tons of ENG per year, which is a very significant contribution to accelerating the energy transition. Our mantra at TESS is PPWS, put the panels where it's sunny. And of course, the wind turbines where it's windy. And so we start with the renewable energy from solar and wind. We use electrolyzers to turn water into hydrogen, splitting the oxygen and the H2. And we then add the CO2 to the H2 with the Sabatier process, creating the CH4. And it sounds complex, but it's actually a lot simpler than producing fossil natural gas. At that point, we have our ENG, and this is a drop-in solution that we can use to replace natural gas and other fossil fuels in many, many applications.